Uh, the U.S. Secretary of Agriculture stopped by Jackson today to meet with conservation workers. Eyewitness News reporter Chelsea Brenzel shows us why. How far can you get with a, this kind of work? For? U.S. Secretary of the Department of Agriculture Tom Vilsack made an appearance in Jackson today. Continue to focus on ways in which we can uh, leverage scarce resources and try to make the case uh, that this area and all of our national forests and grassland areas are worthy of investment. Vilsack said conservation and maintenance is important for the Cowboy State. Billions of dollars of economic activity every single year helps to support tens of thousands of jobs here in this state. People from all over come to see the beautiful place we call home. This is an extraordinary treasure, and it is indeed a national treasure. The secretary says accountability is key to keeping our treasure safe. Since much of the land that is used in recreation is publicly owned, it is important for those of us who have the responsibility of maintaining those public lands to understand and to appreciate how important it is to the economy that we do our job. But one of the largest threats to our forests are fires. This year, there have already been 23,000 forest fires. In a, any given year, that number can rise to 60 to 70 to as many as 100,000 forest fires. Nearly half of the Forest Service budget goes to fighting forest fires. And they are indeed just as much a natural disaster as a flood is, or a tornado, or a hurricane. In the past six years, America has spent over $1 billion on wildfires every year. Vilsack is looking to change the way it's allocated. We're just simply talking about spending the money to fight fires from a, a slightly different source, which in turn would give the chief the capacity and the ability not to have to borrow. He says this would give more money to improving trails for recreation. One, two, three. In Jackson, I'm Chelsea Brensel.